I got prepared to lift this off the mini and I started working out so I could get extra strength and then I walked over to the tire and attempted to lift it up but it was really heavy and I dropped it back onto the mini but eventually I got it up and I threw it off of him But anyways, my dudes, I got a crazy story for you. Like, there's a reason why we're filming right now. And that's because 2.34953259356 seconds ago, I legitimately was, like, leaving my house like a normal human being. And whenever I walked outside, I saw something. Like, there was something on my stairs, so I picked it up. And it was a piece of paper, and it was a note. Like, it said something on it, and I couldn't believe what it said. So I ran back inside so I could come out here and I could show you guys the note. So I have the note right here that I found on my front porch. And it literally says, call me. And then it has a random phone number on it. Now I was trying to figure out whose phone number this was before I called it. But then I had a genius idea. So I checked my security camera footage because I have a security camera watching my house. And I saw who left me this note. So here's the security footage right here up on the screen. And as you guys can see, it just looks like a normal day on my front yard at my house. When all of a sudden, out of nowhere, Gru literally showed up to my house. Like Gru from Despicable Me. And he was just like standing there looking around when all of a sudden he threw the note that I found on my front porch onto the ground. Like he's the one that put it there. And then after he threw the piece of paper down, he just left my house. Oh, snap. So, my dudes, I'm assuming that this is legitimately Gru's phone number and he wants me to call him. No, guys, if you don't remember in my last video, Gru literally fought Vector in real life because Gru actually stole money from me a while back. Like, the minion stole it from me and Vector was trying to help me get my money back. But Gru ended up fighting Vector and stealing his minion back that we were going to use to trade for my money. No! right now to see what he wants. Maybe he's gonna actually give me my money back. Let's do this. Let's do this. All right, let's go ahead and start typing this phone number in. Five, 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 three, nine, eight, zero, one, nine, four. Now I'm gonna hit call and it's ringing, guys. It's literally ringing right now. Come on, crew, pick up the phone. Hurry up, I need to talk to you to see what you wanted to tell me. Oh, guys, he just picked up the phone. Um, hello, is this Gru? Yes, this is Gru. Is this Tord? Yeah, it is. Gru, what do you want? Are you going to, like, give me my money back? Tord, I am not the one that stole your money. What? That was evil Gru and the evil minions. I'm here to help you get your money back. Wait, so this was evil Gru this whole time? And it wasn't you that was, like, stealing the money from me and stuff? Yes, it was evil Gru and evil minions the whole time. Oh They're God. the ones that tried to steal your truck and the ones who took your money. from Evil Gru. You need to find where Evil Gru is at and tell me where he is. Then me and the minions will go steal the money from him. Okay, Gru. I'll look for Evil Gru and let you know whenever I find out where he is. Thank you, Tork. I'll talk to you later. Goodbye. Oh, okay, good, good, goodbye. Oh my goodness. Guys, I literally just talked to the real Gru. And apparently the Gru that stole my money from me and also tried to steal my beautiful, luxurious truck was literally not the actual Gru and it was Evil Gru. You guys, this is crazy because Evil Gru looks exactly the same as Gru, like the good one. So I had absolutely no idea that the evil one was the one trying to attack me this whole time. And steal everything from me. But yes, guys, that means that the good Gru is still good and there's just a bad one out there. And the good Gru and the minions are gonna actually help me fight the evil Gru and the evil minions to give me my money back. Let's go, baby. Yeah, baby. But my dudes, our mission. 
mission right now if we choose to accept is to find evil Gru so we can let Gru know where he's at so that they can go get the money. So let's go search around for evil Gru right now. Let's do this. Let's do this. All right, my dude. So I am now ready to go search around for evil Gru. I just came inside super fast and I grabbed my car keys because we're going to go drive around and try to find where evil Gru is staying. So I'm not really sure where to start looking, but since evil Gru has been here before, I'm assuming that he probably lives somewhere in this area. Like maybe he's staying in a hotel or something nearby. I don't know my dudes, but we're going to hit the road. Like we're literally going to be driving the super beautiful luxurious car right here. All right, let's hop inside of the car and hurry up and drive away. All right, it is super dark in here. Oh my gosh. Let me open up the garage door. All right, so we just need to hit this button right here. Here we go. All right, the garage door is opening up and then we're going to start up the car and get out of here. Oh my gosh. What the heck? Guys, no way. There's legitimately a minion out there running around in front of my garage right now. And wait, now he's just looking at us like he saw the garage door opened up and he's just staring at us. Oh my goodness, I wonder if it's an evil minion or if it's a good minion. Wait, he just threw a banana on the ground and now he's running away. Oh my gosh, we gotta go chase him down. It must be an evil one. Oh my goodness. Minion, get back here. Oh, stop running. Oh. Guys, I just slipped on the banana. Oh, stupid banana. This makes me so mad. Oh, I'm going to have to absolutely demolish this banana. So I picked up the banana and I started throwing it on the ground over and over again. And then I went to go kick it, but I missed and slipped on it. Oh, my leg. But no way. Guys, I can't believe this. Look, the minion's literally gone. Like, I don't see the minion anywhere. But the minion ran that way. Like, it ran towards the woods back there. But unfortunately, I literally slipped and fell on that banana. And so I didn't even see exactly where the minion went. No. No. Guys, I gotta hurry up and go out here and try to find where the minion went. Come on, let's hurry up before he gets away for good. So I started running out towards where the minion ran towards to try to find where he was at. And I was looking around everywhere. And I went all the way out to the burn pile. Guys, unfortunately, I don't see the minion anywhere. I have absolutely no idea where he went off to. Man, he is super fast, though. But guys, I'm assuming that was probably an evil minion. Because a good minion probably would have stayed. So I think we just spotted one of the evil minions in real life. And wait a minute. Guys, I just had a genius idea. I'm literally going to go grab my drone and we're going to fly it around to try to find out where the minion went. Like, I'm going to try to find him using the drone. And maybe we can follow him back to evil Gru to see where they're staying at so we can tell the actual Gru so he can get my money back. All right, I'm going to go grab my drone right now. Come on, let's go. A few moments later. All right, my dudes, I got my drone right here. I'm going to go put it out outside and we're gonna fly it up into the sky and keep a good bird's eye view out for that minion here we go all right, so I got the drone on the ground right there, my dudes. I'm gonna go inside so that way the minion like doesn't hear me talking to you guys or anything while I'm flying it because I don't want to scare him away. So hopefully he'll come out while I'm flying the drone. Let's fly this bad boy up into the sky. Let's do this. Let's do this. All right, here we go. We're taking off up into the sky. So I flew the drone up into the air. All right, there we go. We are now up in the sky and look how much we can see. And Wow, look at that super epic sunset. That is super beautiful. But anyways, guys, let's go over here. And if I look down, as you can see, that's my garage right there. And so that's where the minion like was at whenever we first saw him and he threw the banana on the ground and then he ran this way, like somewhere out here. And this is where we walked to earlier, like right to that burn pile is where I walked when I had the camera, whenever I had the idea to grab the drone. So we just need to look around this entire area to try to figure out where that minion went. Maybe he's hiding back here somewhere. Let's check behind this ginormous tree. 
Okay, I don't see him back here behind this tree or anything. Wait, what is that right there on the grass? There's something white right there. Let's go down there and see what it is. All right, I'm going lower down towards it. What is that? Oh, wait, I think it's a kitty cat. It is. Guys, look, it's a pretty little cat. All right, we're going to leave you alone. You can enjoy your time out there in the field. Let's continue searching for the minion. And guys, like I said earlier, it's very possible that the minion like ran into the woods over here. Like this is our woods right here and it's a really good hiding spot. Like it's very likely that he ran over here or something. But it's a pretty big oh woods so it'd be God. really hard to find. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Guys, look, that's literally the minion right there. He just actually ran out of the woods. Like that is where he went. And he's just like kind of walking around. Like I don't know where he's going or anything. And wait a minute. That literally looks like it's Gru right there. Like that must be the evil Gru. Evil Gru and the evil minions must be hiding in the woods. And wait, now it looks like Evil Gru and the evil minion are talking. Oh, maybe the evil minion is telling Evil Gru that I saw him or something whenever I opened up my garage door. And wait, look, there they go. They just ran back into the woods again. Yeah. Look, I literally don't see them anymore. No way, they're literally back there somewhere. Like, that must be where Evil Gru and the evil minions are hiding now or in the woods. Guys, you know what? Our new mission right now now if we choose to accept is that I need to go out to the woods and I need to figure out where they're staying in the woods so that way I can tell good Gru so he can go get my money from them. I'm gonna go change my clothes like I'm gonna put on camouflage so that way it's really hard to see me and so that way I can be super sneaky like a ninja and see where they're hiding at and then I'll let good Gru know. So uh, let me go change and then we'll head out there. I'll be back. I'll be back. Stay tuned for my next video where we go into the woods to try to find Evil Gru. Oh, snap.